Hi Taurus, welcome to my channel. This is a mid-month love and general situationship tarot reading session for you Taurus. This is a collective reading for the Taurus friends out there. This is your mid-month reading. Thank you Taurus for coming back. Thank you so much for tuning in. Thank you for being here today. Guest viewers, if you haven't clicked the bell, click the bell and click subscribe. And for those who would like to further connect with me Taurus, I invite you to also follow me on my blog. Um, the name of the blog is sunshine-tv.com. We send out newsletter about astrology, new moon, full moon. And um, we also send a bonus reading. It is via the website. So if you would like to further connect with me and receive that newsletter, I invite you also to please subscribe in our website. The link is down in the description box below. This is for you, Taurus. Let's see what's coming towards you. This is a mid -month reading. This is a collective reading for the Taurus friends out there. Let's see what is the message towards you in love, dating, getting to know, career and finance, and other important message for you. In today's reading, Taurus, we'll be looking at the past, the current energy, immediate future, predictive outcome and advice. And depending on the message for today, I will let you know if there's a need to extend the reading, okay? So this is for you, Taurus. Let me just ground my energy. What is the message for Taurus, please? Okay, coming in the past is you've got the Empress card in reverse. You've got the Ace of Wands and the Star card in reverse. Um, it seems to be you are in your element, okay? You are in your Taurus area. Uh, you are, it seems to be Ace of Wands. You've, you've got something, okay? You've, you've got something. You're, you're holding on to something. You're holding on the Ace of Wands. You're holding on to hope, okay? You are holding on into something that makes you happy. It makes you feel excited. It is by default yours. However, this Ace of Wands, you know, this, it could be your dream. Ace of Wands represents passionate connection, creative energy. It's a new beginning. It is an idea for some of you guys. Um, it's an upright position. However, this Ace of Wands, it is surrounded by the Empress card in reverse and the Star card in reverse. So there is, I'd say, challenging person or energy that is preventing you to be successful with the Ace of Wands. It could be a new love. It could be... Um, a new creative adventure, a new hobby, a new job, something new that makes you feel excited. There's a, it's not a block, okay? Um, let's, let's put it this way. It, it is, whatever you want, Taurus, whatever you want, it's big. It's big, it's ambitious, it's life-changing for some of you guys. It, it is, if you start this now and you carry on up until next year, this could be the next big thing, okay? And I see you and I feel you, you're not surrendering because this is a big part of your life, a big part of your journey, a big part of what's next to you. Like this will carry over, whatever this is, Ace of Wands, until 2022. So you're not giving up, in short. You're surrounded by, I don't know, opponents or... Um, competition or something to do, distraction for some of you, but you're not giving up. Like you're holding the Ace of Wands close to your heart, you know, close to your heart. It could be a dream, a very ambitious. Um, so you're holding into that hope, into that dream, into that next big thing for you. Um, in the current energy, you've got the Eight of Wands in reverse, Nine of Swords, the Six of Wands. Obviously, there is quite a challenge into getting the Ace of Wands in, in flame. You know, there's a, you're, there's a victory already, you know, the Ace of Wands is here. You, you've, you've started off something in the past or you could still be... You could still be in this energy where it's exciting. I want this. Yes, there's a bit of challenge. There's block. There's competition. But I'm not going to give up. There's an element of it. There's an element of surprise in here as well where, you know, something came up and it gives you more and more hope for some of you guys. And a lot of 
Ace of Wands. Like there's a lot of energy coming from you that I want it and I will get it, you know. And to want it and to get it, you know, from, from wanting it and getting it. Because when if you want to, I want it. If you want to get it, then you need to put an action. You need to plant a seed in order for it to grow and maintain and transform the Ace of Wands to the Six of Wands victory. So there's some sort of development, developing story in here. There are good times. There's up, you know, like there's an approve with the Ace of Wands. Something is a, you you've been approved something, something, you you win. There is a winning moment with the Ace of Wands. However, you have a tight um, deadline, or you have a you're holding this Ace of Wands because you don't want to lose it. It's still a continuing continue. It's a next big thing for some of you guys. It's life changing for some of you. So you want to make sure that this Ace of Wands it doesn't stay as an Ace of Wands. You want to transform it to a Six of Wands. You know, Ace of Wands one, two of Wands, three of Wands, four of Wands, five of Wands, six of Wands. So the journey is still quite far from that victory, but you started it off with an Ace of Wands. So you had a good start. And you want a victory. Now, we cannot deny some sort of acknowledgement in here that to get to the six, sorry, to get to the six of ones to victory, you need to plan, maintain. There's a lot of things that you need to do to make sure that the ace of ones is secure to you. It could be a person, a situation, an offer. Now, in the current energy, you've got the eight of ones. This is ace. This is eight. It's possible, Taurus, that you jump so quickly into something that it led you to a six of wands it means that there's a roadblock because you went to the shortcut you know like the ace of wands to be to be victorious you need to follow the the road to success okay ace of wands two of wands three of wands four of wands five of wands but maybe you're too excited or maybe sometimes we want this thing, this person, this offer so much that we tend to be clumsy. We tend to create a back door or a shortcut. And instead of getting successful, we have encountered a backflow or six of wands. Not good outcome. It is a roadblock. I'd say whatever you're experiencing right now, it's a delay. But it doesn't mean that you cannot win over this delay. The delay or the road bump, this delay, it is actually encouraging you, Taurus, to reroute and go back to the normal route. Don't take a shortcut. Okay? Something tells me that what you were doing, it was a good start. Then you went something out of line. Like, you cut off the thing and... You went for a shortcut, and that is where you and your person, your situation got delayed. You know, it, it's kind of feeling like you're stuck somewhere, but you could still board the plane and fly and soar and be victorious, okay? So it's not an end game. Um, in the immediate future, predictive outcome and advice, you've got the six of pentacles in reverse. It could be you are recalculating and recalibrating your budget, your time, your effort. You're picking up the piece where, where did I have the mistake? Where did I left it off somewhere out there? I want to find that issue, that mistake that led me to this roadblock. You're kind of recalibrating your style, your money, uh, your approach. You know, like, I feel like, you know, the world card, the way forward is to go back. And review where did I went wrong and I feel like Taurus if you retrace or reverse back and you start from scratch and you follow the systematic approach or the right sequence instead of the shortcut you will find the culprit the page of ones page of ones in reverse it's like you will find the main issue you will find why things is not actually as successful as it is or why things between you and your person, your situation, it's not as, as the desired outcome that you want. The answer is in the past. 
does something that you did in the past or you and your person or your offer or this situation that it's leading to the past. And that is where you actually can fix that issue there in order to connect the past to the present and update everything and for everything to be in alignment, to go back, to reroute. You know, it's like a GPS or navigation. You know, you thought this was the shortcut, but actually it led you somewhere else. You got lost, but it doesn't mean that you cannot find your way back. Because in here, you still have a time to reroute back, to start from scratch and follow the right sequence, the right order, and get there, the six of wands, the success that you want, okay? You know, ideally, this is what you want. Ace of wands, one, two, three, four, five, six, six is victorious. Okay, so Taurus, whatever you're doing, I feel like from now up until the immediate future, it, it's good to recalibrate, to review. And sometimes the most traditional way or the right way is actually the normal way instead of the speedy or shortcut way. So I feel like you're, you're going to go to the traditional way in order to win this and you still have time. Okay. So Taurus, whatever this is, take it easy. You know what to do. There's a trace back or tracking back where you can pinpoint where you should correct, improve, or revise. And I feel like, you know, there is a Venus retrograde coming soon. So this is a time for you to go introspection and to think about how you relate towards a person or a situation. Okay? So Taurus... Thank you so much for being here. Thanks for supporting my channel. It is a pleasure doing the reading to you guys. I hope you've connected with me. I hope this reading has served its purpose to you. I really hope that you would still further connect with me. Join me in my blog, sunshine-tv.com. We send out bonus reading, new moon, full moon, and astrology update, and anything under the sunshine story. <laughs> so please do check it out. And yeah, click the bell, click subscribe, and I'll see you soon again, guys. You have a great day. Bye-bye.